whether it's receivers or cornerbacks, I think we have the best, if not one of the best in the NFL. So on right. both sides of the ball. Um, Let's see. So next one we have kind of the final one. Geno Smith has over 4,200 passing yards. Um, last year he had 40, 4,200, uh, 4,282. Um, I'm going to say, I'm going to say under, I feel like this is the year that I don't know. I I don't know if he's the, I mean, his age, I just great story, but I don't think I'm not, see, I'm not worried about that. His age. I'm, Cause he doesn't, he has a lot of tread left on the tires. Cause he hasn't been used like Plays, a normal 34 year old quarterback. What I think is we're going to be a lot more. We're going to be on a lot more lower scoring games. I think right. our defense is really going to step it up this year. And I don't think he's going to have to throw for 4,200 passing yards. That was a franchise record last year. Yeah. So I don't think he breaks his own record. I think he probably throws for, let's say 3,750. We'll yeah. say that. I, I agree. Um, you have a guy who, even though he, like I said, great story, but I just don't know if he, I mean, he's not like an elite quarterback every year. So it's like, I feel like you guys definitely lean a little bit. And 28, 29 pass per, passes per game is quite a bit, I would say. So Well, and you got to look at, too, we were behind, especially the second yeah. half of the season. The season, And then the first half of the season, um, we were in a couple blowouts or uh, shootouts there with, uh, with the Lions. I think we scored like 45 points. And then the... Uh, the Saints, I think it was a pretty high set. There was a few high scoring games that uh, shouldn't have been because of our defense. So hopefully that gets shored up this year. Yeah. Um. Let's see. Uh, I'm trying to get to your guys' comments here. I apologize if I don't get anything. Uh, I called the 